Good morning! It's 11.30. It's still morning. Oh, that's true. I guess it's afternoon. Welcome back to Young at the Parks. Uh, we're both very tired. Yeah, if you follow us on Instagram, you know that we moved into our new house two days ago. Two days ago. And uh, we've been doing a lot of work in the new house, getting acclimated, unpacking as much as we can, fixing things, changing things, cleaning things. So much cleaning. Uh, we're both exhausted from that. And today, just mere hours ago, Kelly completed her first duathlon. Woohoo! Congratulations, yeah, that's thank amazing. Thank you. Um, so if you don't know, a duathlon is just like a triathlon minus the swimming. So it is a multi-sport event where you run, cycle, run. Um, it was a lot of fun, but it was really hard. <laughs> um, do not do a race two days after you move into a new house because yeah. it will make training that much more harder and stressful. Oh, yeah. uh, my goal was to complete it within two hours and I did it with in an hour and about 50 minutes total. Um, and I think that was because I was really worried we were going to miss this reservation for brunch at Disney Springs. Um, but I did it. Yeah. So super excited and yep, ready for some brunch. Yes, we're here at Disney Springs today for a short visit to go to the Dueling Pianos Captain's Brunch at the Boathouse. Very excited. Uh, and we're doing this intro in the car because it is a torrential downpour outside. Yeah. I checked the radar before we left. We were supposed to get like 0 0.01 inches of rain, a little tiny band. It's like a hurricane outside. So yeah. film the intro in the car. Probably won't film too much till we get to brunch. Um, but in any case, uh, thanks we'll, Florida. Yeah, thanks Florida. But uh, yeah, we'll see you in a sec. Hey, this is going to be interesting filming wise because it is a captain sing along with dueling pianos. Uh, one pianist is from Jelly Roll, so there's a lot of copyrighted music. So let's quickly show off the menu. Uh, classic brunch menu, steak and eggs, chicken, biscuit, and gravy, uh, crab cake, Benedict. Uh, they got a Belgian waffle, they got avocado toast, lots of boat drinks. Uh, if you want some regular food, they also got oysters, they got a red grouper. Uh, they also have the full lunch menu over here, uh, if you want to see that. And uh, now that the music has stopped for a moment, uh, they do have their classic rolls, but this time they are covered in cinnamon icing. Does still have butter on the side. Just use both. Oh yeah. So good. We can't confirm that these uh, rolls are very good, especially with the cinnamon sugar icing and put butter on it. Just go all whole hog. It's so good. Uh, Kelly got a mimosa uh, because if you wear a captain's hat, you get a free mimosa. Pro tip: We don't advertise this, but if you wear a captain's hat or a boathouse shirt from their boutique gift shop, you get a free. Yeah, Kelly got a delicious mimosa. I got a pear mosa, which is recording uh, pear and some juice and uh, champagne. It's, it's, it's good. It's very good. All right, for the next song starts, Kelly got the steak and eggs, petit filet, home fries, and uh, some tasty eggs. And I got the crab cake hollandaise, uh, crab cake benedict. Looks very good with asparagus. Well, the sun's out, and uh, I left my sunglasses in the car, so enjoy me squinting. Um, yeah, since they changed the rules, we can take our masks off when we do videos and pictures and stuff, yeah. so that's fun. We're um, away from everybody, and, we're, we're, and I've been fully vaxxed, and you're between doses. Yeah, but I yeah. go, I, uh, I go still, in we, a little bit. You know us, we always wear our masks yeah. and we follow the rules, and we've been safe, so. Yeah, today's Sunday, tomorrow is my second dose. Yay! So, that's exciting. Get vaxxed. Yep. Um, so, what do you think of brunch? It was really good. Yes, it was very, very so, good. So, it's not a secret that the Boathouse is our favorite restaurant on Walt Disney World property, and brunch was, of course, no exception. Super good. It was good. really, really yummy. The rolls, those Parker House style rolls with the cinnamon sugar icing were oh, yeah. chef's kiss. Yeah. Um, my steak and eggs was really, really good. The um, steak was cooked perfectly. Oh, yeah. Eggs were great. Um, it's a little pricey, but that's just because it's Boathouse. Yeah. It's the, I forget what their meat like rating it's is. It's pretty high up there. You know. Um, um, and I really liked my yeah. crab uh, Benedict. Um, one thing though, it is very Old Bay. So it's Old Bay Hollandaise. There's a lot of Old Bay in it. So if you like Old Bay, get it. I love Old Bay. I, I literally put it on pretty much everything. Really so um, if you like it, get it. If you're so-so about it, maybe don't. Um, but I loved it. It was very, very tasty. And your drink? The pure, uh, it pure was okay. Mosa? It was alright. It was fine. It wasn't anything mm -hmm. bad. It was just nothing special. So I don't know if I'd get that again. No. 
Um, but overall, definitely worth checking out. The Absolutely. brunch um, after tip, it was about $88.50. Yeah. So it is a so, special occasion yeah. brunch. Like, yes, for sure. For us, yeah. you know, budget friendly. Yep. But. Um, you know, it's a nice. I'm so glad we tried it. Yeah, absolutely. It was amazing. Definitely be back. Yeah. Just not every weekend. Yeah. Well, all that rain seems to have driven away some of the crowds. That's a very cute draft picture. Um, so we're gonna do a couple small stops here in Disney Springs. Going to uh, go over to the Marketplace Co-op because uh, they've got something special and very excited to show you that continues with our nautical theme. And uh, I might go into pin traders as well. Here it is. A brand new pop-up Disney Cruise Line at where magic meets the sea. Pop-up store has arrived at the Marketplace Co-op. Let's, uh, let's head over here. That is the Disney Dream. Great ship, haven't been on it in a very long time. They've got lots and lots of DCL merch from Castaway Key and from On The Ships. Let's go inside, check it out, and see if they have any of that fun misspelling. Let's see, we've got some spare jerseys. Oh, I do like that hat. The Tucker hat? No, no, the other one. Oh, the white one? Remember you, all, you were looking at the pictures like of it? it? It's really cute. I just don't have a really good in white hat. Alright, you don't you've never worn a white hat. That's why, because I don't know if I look good in them. I like the little emblems here on the back. That's cute. How much is that? Um, the tag is ripped off oh. that one, so I will see. There's no tag on that one either. Maybe it's on the inside. No, it's on the not inside. Smart. Correct. $27.99. That's not too bad. Yeah, lots of spear jerseys well, here they take for these cruise line. Um, club silver. No gold. Or gold. Oh I was gonna say, excuse gold. me. Excuse me, sorry. Cruise line, sure. We got a uh, cruise line luggage. There you are. That's yeah, cute. Look how that is. That's cool. pretty good. What's on the What's on the back? Anything? Nothing. Do it. I am obsessed with crop sweatshirts. Yeah, get it for really sure. Cute. I love it. Shirts for little kids. We got cups. I got more little shirts. We got little shorts. We got more cups. We got bigs. Thirty five dollars for that big. We got little bags. We got littler bags. We got some shirt dresses, some pants, and some jackets, more spirit jerseys, oh, some frames, cute, and a blanket. And blanket's okay. Oh, it's a beach blanket. Huh. It says, don't touch. No, it actually says Disney Cruise Line and not her flags. That was a trivia that you got incorrect. Go with. Anyways, let's continue on. They have a Disney Cruise Line towel. That's a nice towel. We have the ears. It is not a blanket. We got some magnets and mini magnets. They don't want to go into focus. That's, That's a really kid's nice. shirt. Oh. It is? How do you know? Pretty sure it is. I mean, I don't see it anywhere else. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she unwrapped it. It is very, very cute. It is very, very cute. Adorable. Adorable. More picture frames. No, not even close. <laughs> um, what'd you do with your uh, thing? Okay. Oh, you, well, you have two. Because I don't know what size I'm going to try oh, That's fair. Okay. We got phone cases. We have uh, some jackets here. Kind of windbreaker type jackets. Uh, this long sleeve shirt with a little uh, rope tie there on the neck. Uh, some more hats, some nice hats. We got some polo shirts, some men's shirts. Uh, yeah, another spear jersey, a blue striped spear jersey. That's kind of nice. There's a cruise line in the back, very nice. I like that a lot. Yeah. Um, we got this pretty nice hat, almost kind of like a working shirt. Looks pretty good. Uh, some more polos, hat there. We got your golf balls, more hats, socks, tie. Some pajama shorts and pants. Thank you for having pajama shorts. We're in Florida, people. It's hot here. Too hot for pants. Reversible jacket. Kind of a jersey material. I like that. Nice. Got a shirt here. Pretty good. And as we comb around, dressing rooms are closed. I don't know where you're trying that on. I'm just gonna do it. <laughs> it's gonna do it? Okay. 
Now we have the Disney Cruise Line dresses here from the dress shop. Really cute. Super cute, love it. And some of the last stuff we have, the Seas Every Day hat and line. See you in my dreams. Disney Cruise Line. Disney Cruise Line. And then lots of mini merch here as well. In this section they have Castaway Key merch. They have a hoodie jacket there with relax, unwind, and enjoy. Castaway Key Bahamas. Sorry. As Kelly almost drops on the floor. Hi. We have pajama pants. We have a uh, beach cover up. We've got a hat, which is nice. We also have a whole family set of these white uh, Castaway Key, white and blue designs here. They have it in a button up shirt, dresses, kids' shirts and dresses. Kids shirts and dresses, women's dresses, kind of high up shirts here. A really cool design from Castaway Key, including, of course, Mount Rustmore. As, as part of that new line, they have these really amazing rainbow type of color, very 70s actually, not so much rainbow, um, last fly bags. And they're uh, they're kind of vinyl, they're kind of plasticky sort of. Which it's nice. It's nice. It's nice, like for Florida weather. Like I yeah. wouldn't be scared with this getting like super wet. Exactly. So I like it. It's it's super nice. It's cool. And it's uh seventy dollars. We're probably gonna have to do a haul video when we get home because we sort of went on a little bit of a shopping spree. Uh, and then I didn't film any of it because I'm still kind of out of it from being tired from the move, and it's been a crazy day. So and Disney Springs itself is getting even busier. So uh, we're gonna walk around a little bit more and then uh, we might see you back at the house. I don't know, we'll, we'll see what happens in a bit here. Yeah. One last stop in Disney style here. They actually have the goat shirt, multiple meetings, all of them amazing. Hello, welcome well, back. Welcome back to Casa de Young. We, as you can see, oh, yeah. we are uh, still unpacking. Yeah. Is a mess, we will, we'll do a proper kind of home tour vlog at some point. You can see my Squidward painting over there. Yeah, uh, yeah we got the got the new floors in. Yay! Some good, some good and bad. We got to deal with the uh, companies on that. Things, but yeah. um, and I would sit closer to Kelly, but my spot got taken. It's okay. But I see him in roll. Hello, Frank sir. Frank the cat has been very happy here. He's loving this place. He really is. Yeah. He's been so good. So, anyways. Yeah, so we left the springs. It was raining again, um, so we didn't film an outro. And as you saw at the end, we did a lot of shopping. Um, I don't know what it is. The last couple times we've gone to the springs, we buy yeah. a lot of stuff. So we thought we would show you a little mini haul with what we bought. Yeah. First up is my new lunchbox. This is um, Jared Mariyama's Wonderground Gallery collection that came out, I think a couple months ago now, maybe a month ago. And for a while, the lunchbox was only being sold in the parks, but I finally saw it at Disney Springs, because y'all know we haven't been to the parks in a while, and I'm so sorry, trust me. All we want to do is go back and avoid real life. Um, it's true. But how cute, and I do need a new lunchbox for work. Plenty of storage on the inside. Very nice. I'm obsessed. He is one of my favorite Wonderground um, Disney artists. So I love that. And then I got this sweatshirt. If you guys watched the earlier part of the video, you'll know that I saw this in the Disney Cruise Line pop up in Marketplace co op. And. Yeah. Super cute. Does y'all know I need another sweatshirt? It's true. Um, it's really nice. It's pretty thin, but it's like super soft on the inside. Um, they have a matching lounge fly backpack, which I kind of regret not getting. Yeah, we're probably gonna end up getting it. You guys, anytime I like celebrate something like my birthday or my race this morning, I feel the need to just treat myself to all the things. So it's fine. All right, what else do we get? Well, funny you should ask. My Frank. I think the rest is yours. Uh, no, it is not. Oh, it's not. I, I forgot. forgot. A new friend, Winnie the Pooh from Disney New Emos. You guys know that Joe got me Kermit the Frog for my birthday, 
and Hundred Acre Wood Gang just came out like last week and I saw Pooh Bear and I had to get him. It's pretty cute. He's really cute. <clears throat> These are the posable little um, friends that they came out with really big in Japan and um, I love them. And then I did get a outfit. This one is for Kermit because I think um, Kermit the Frog would look really good in a black leather jacket. It's pretty good. Um, and then it comes with like jean shorts and I think I'm going to put the jean shorts on Winnie the Pooh because I think it's really funny that he never wears pants but I'm going to give him some because I didn't really like any of the Pooh outfits. They had a bunch of like business suits that were like dap like a business like poo. a pinstripe suit um, yeah. but I didn't see them at World of Disney so. Mm. These are my new friends. Love it. I am, uh, I just turned 29. I love them. My turn for my <gasps> haul. So I got, of course, the goat shirt that we showed in Disney, Disney style. style. Um, it is part of the Our Universe line, which is an offshoot of her universe from the Big Thunder Mountain Railroad. So not only is it the greatest of all time, but it's also the goat. It's great. I love it. Um, and then from there, I also got a lot of pins. Um, so we have the uh, Germany mini pin here, which I like a lot. I love her. Um, they came out recently with Epcot pins for basically each of the countries. Um, so we got two pins from Germany because I really liked them a lot. Those there. And we actually went there on our honeymoon. We did. So we had lots of Germany pins. Uh, we also got a uh, Italian pin, Italy pin. I like that one a lot. It's cute. Does anyone speak Italian and know what this one says? All I know is Muscuzzi from Eurotrip. Oh, well, I don't think it says that. <laughs> it says me. Well, I don't even want to try Ice this. Ice cream, anyways. <laughs> uh, last but not least, we got this really, really cool. Disney Cruise Line pin. It's so cool. I love this pin. A plus pin. So that wraps up our day at Disney Springs for a amazing brunch at the boathouse. Continue to absolutely love the boathouse. The best. It is the best. truly Go there. one of the best restaurants on Disney property. I think Potentially it's the, best. the best. I think it's the best. Up for debate. There's a what, lot of very good restaurants. What would you say is the best? I don't know. I'd have to think about it. I don't know. There's too many restaurants. If you can't think about it, it's the boathouse. Okay. And we actually recently made a list of like all the restaurants on Walt Disney World property in the resorts and the parks, etc. And we've been to like almost 70% of them. But a lot of them. Which is them, yeah. huge because there's like 200 total, including quick service. But yes. um, I'm going to just go on record and say it's the best. Don't sleep on it. Go for lunch. Go for dinner. It's a little bit pricier, but it is. It's good it's for special occasions, it. and it's honestly, if you just want to treat yourself, yeah. just check it out. It's good. You seafood, steak, you know, anything you want yeah, under the sun, drinks. they probably got it. Drinks, yes, just fantastic. The, atmosphere. the boat house, even even beer, the boathouse beer that yeah, they really they like have that here longer. from I think it's from Florida Brewing Co. or Tampa Brewing Co. I can't. I haven't been able to find it anywhere else besides the boathouse, and I honestly think it's just. The name that's the same. It's not necessarily a boathouse exclusive drink. Um, phenomenal. Yeah. It's a nice lager. That that's good. Um, so if you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Uh, in the comments down below, if you have been to the Dueling Pianos Captain's Brunch at the Boathouse, let us know your thoughts. Uh, if you're collecting any of the country pins, let us know. Yeah. If you also went on a shopping spree around the Springs, and even in the Disney Cruise Line shop, in the co-op, let I us did. know. We want to know what you got. I did. Tell you me what I should get next time. Yes. Well, it's going to be the backpack. I'm just going to put that out there. I regret not getting that She's Disney gonna, Cruise Line lounge fly. Backpack. If you want to see more of our adventures, make sure to subscribe. Click on that bell icon to get notified every time we go live with new videos. And as always, we will see you next time for more Young at the Parks. Bye.